So, um, today we are going to be discussing about the uh, method statements, inspection requests on site. So, can you help us, the viewers, elaborate on what um, we call a method statement? So, what is a method statement when it comes to electrical engineering works on site? Uh, first of all, I want to say thank you so much for inviting me. You're welcome. And also to I'd like to create an awareness so people can understand exactly what our method statement is as well as our inspection request as well. And generally, it's not specified in this particular field, it's something which is put across all the different engineering uh, fields when it comes to construction. So, when we talk of method statement, it's a safe system of work. It's a way by which we will have to submit a method statement and then put down certain points in which we are going to use in carrying out the different method statements. So it varies from different activities. Okay. Yeah. And which one now is the inspection request? Where does the inspection request come in? Inspection request um, actually is um, after carrying out a set of activities on site, you submit the inspection request to prove the quality of work that you carried out on site. I'll give an example. If I carry out installation of work, probably installation of a uh, business conduit and back up installation, for example, in uh, the field of electrical engineering. Mm -hmm. So what I'll do is I prepare and uh, put set of documents. This okay. is the inspection request submission. Mm -hmm. So I'll put down set of documents, compile them together, and then on the front page I'm going to give a description of that particular inspection that is going to be inspected on site. I submit to the consultant, make sure that it conforms to the requirement of the project, and then he will have uh, finally give a, a, a remark. It should be either code A, code B, or code C, okay. depending on what is inside. All right, thank you for elaborating on that point concerning the, the method statement and the inspection request. So, what if um, the inspection request does not conform with the method statement? What happens? Yeah, um, like I did mention, actually, a method statement should be submitted first okay. before proceeding with the installation of that work, oh, before okay. going in for the inspection request for consultant to come on site to check if this work is carried out. The requirement or not. So basically, you submit the method statement and then you outline all the different steps or the methodology that the way the work is going to be carried out. Mm -hmm. You mention the materials to be used, you mention the tools and the way in which you will carry out this certain work, work with quality as well as safety, okay. which is very important. So you outline all that, you submit to the consultant once it's approved prior to proceeding with that activity on site. So okay. once you submit, proceed with the installation of site, that is when you will be able, after carrying out the installation, you will now submit an inspection request before the consultant will come on site and check if the work is quality or not. Wow, that's good. And you made mention of um, some codes. You mentioned code A, B, and C, and C I think. Yeah. So tell us more about this code. We say code A, code B, code C is a way of giving an appraisal for a particular submission that you've done. It, so, it code, is code A the highest? The highest. Code A is the highest, which has no comment. Mm -hmm. Code B, it's approved so okay. with some comments, and the comments will be minor comments. Okay, then what about the code C? Code C, C now, revise and resubmit with comments that are major. So, in mm. this case, you cannot proceed with succeeding activities. Okay, so we understand that when uh, a method statement is, is given a code uh, C, you cannot move further. You can't move further. Okay. Thank you so much for elaborating for us. I'm sure the viewers too um, would understand what a method statement is all about when it comes to construction and electrical works, um, as well as the inspection uh, request. So thank you, Mr. Kome, for joining us on set today.